breaking news. Simeon Iqbal speaks on a dozen Peter Obi's presidential ambition that got Nigerians talking. Controversial Biafra Nation activist and self acclaimed dis dis disciple of Mazi Nandikano, Simeon Iqbal has reacted to the report that he has endorsed the presidential bid of former governor of Anambra State, Mr. Peter Obi. Simeon Ekman had through his Twitter handle and Radio Biafra reiterated that elections will not hold across the Igbo land in 2023. According to him, 2023 is for Biafra referendum and official restoration of the defunct Biafra nation. Hence, while reacting to reports that the leadership of the organizing Digbo and others have endorsed the candidacy of Peter Obi for the 2023 presidential election, he declared that such an act amounts to fertility, describing the Igbo elders as ignorant. He explained that the dangerous diversity of Nigeria it is major reason for bad leadership in the country. According to him, the Igbo leaders have since 1960 been endorsing presidential candidates with nothing to show for such an act. Those ignorant headers telling me they endorse Peter Obi, my question to you all is what do you have to show for all the endorsements of candidates since 1960? You keep endorsing, thinking the problem is the leaders. The problem is of Nigeria, is of Nigeria. Dangerous diversity. Got that to your head, he tweeted. He reiterated that elections will not hold in Igbo land. It's a tax that must be actualized, as well as the restoration of Biafra. No election is tax that we don't, we are only waiting to hear news of Biafra, read declaration, he has said. Hmm. Someone said, Ikbam, now man, you be, you be that respect, okay, we move, okay? I can't really get what that person is trying to say. So guys, what's your take concerning this? Controversial Biafra Nation activist and self-acclaimed disciple of Mazen Namdikano. Simeon Ekman has reacted to the report that he has endorsed the presidential bid of the former governor of Anambra State, Mr. Peter Obi. Simeon Ekman had through his Twitter handle and Radio Biafra reiterated that election will not hold across the Igbo land in 2023. According to him, 2023 is for Biafra referendum and official restoration of the defunct Biafra nation. Hence, while reacting to reports that the leadership of the organizing Digbo and others have endorsed the candidacy of Peter Obi for the 2023 presidential election, he declared that such an act amounts to uh, fertility describing the Igbo leaders as ignorant. He explained that the dangerous diversity of Nigeria is its major reason for bad leadership in the country. According to him, the Igbo elders have since 1960 been endorsing presidential candidates with nothing to show for such an act. Those ignorant elders telling me they endorse Peter would be my question to you all is what do you have to show for all the endorsements of candidates since 1960 you keep endorsing thinking the problem is the leaders the problem is of nigeria dangerous diversity get that to your head he tweeted he reiterated that elections will not hold in Igbo land it is a tax that must be actualized, as well as the restoration of Biafra. No election is taxed that we 
have done. We are only waiting to hear news of Biafra redeclaration. This man is causing so much problem in these Biafra agitations in the north, in the southeast. Honestly speaking, these are the people who are giving IPOB a bad name. Simeon Iqbal should be arrested. These are reactions by Nigerians. I think Simeon Iqbal have just said it all. No election in the Southeast come 2023. Nigerian leaders can never be trusted. We are not after elections. We are after our nation. So I support Simeon Iqbal on this. May God have mercy on you people. Just look at the way you are using your hands to destroy your own people. You people are agitating because you said the Nigerian government are neglected, have neglected you for a long time. Now you have an Igbo man as a presidential candidate. Why can't you just support him? And now you are saying that election will not be held in, in the southeast come 2023 i pity those who are not saying that you people will lead them to destruction hmm. someone said simeon ikban is not a a member of biafran agitator but he is being used by the same nigerian government to commit atrocities well that is his own problem we are not with him. He's on his own anyway. <laughs> they say, well, I'll be like bicycle. So my people, these are reactions by Nigerians. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you very much for this stopping by. Bye for now.